wanna feel cold in the morning, stealing covers off of me. Oh, every imperfection, every scar. Not a thing could change the person. Hello, friends. It's Jennifer. I hope you're doing really well and having an amazing day so far. So today, as you read from the title, decorate for fall with me. I am so excited about today's season and decorating our little home. So today I have decided to decorate our little cozy apartment, our little home for autumn. Technically, autumn begins at the end of this month of September, but I'm just doing a little head start. Just feel the coziness and have it last for a little bit longer. So last year, I did have have a decor fall video out. I released it pretty late so I decided to have a head start start decorating. I really hope you guys enjoyed this autumn decorate with me and just to create a cozy atmosphere of our little home. I am so happy to spend the rest of the day with you guys. Today I'm gonna start off with the living room and then we're gonna make our way to the kitchen and then the bathroom and I might add some little decor in my office room we will see how that goes and i am so happy to share and show you guys more of my decor that i have from last year and as you saw on my last video i did film a shop with me so that is what we're going to be doing today decorate our little home i am so happy to spend the rest of the day with you guys and it, it is a pretty sunny day and it gives me joy. The sun is finally out. Hopefully this year of this season, we will have plenty of sunshine. So this is my cozy outfit for today. Just wearing this cute dress that I purchased back in Florida. It's really cute. I really love it. It's really nice and comfy and cozy. So yeah, so let's get on decorating our little home. And before we get started, I want to get really comfy and cozy and make myself a my leftover that i had starbucks when i did my shopping with me i'm going to warm that up and so i can get into the coziness and turn on some autumn music on youtube get really situated i really hope you guys get really cozy let's head to the kitchen and have a cozy hot coffee <music> they have oh it looks like they have cozy autumn autumn cozy so i'm gonna try the cozy autumn jazz lately i've been listening to a lot of jazz i really love jazz music it's so calm and peaceful and relaxing i'm gonna go with this one it feels so great to sit down and drink this. Cheers, friends. While I was cooking this, my husband noticed the smell of this cozy smell. It lightened the room and it made the room smell so cozy and really nice. I just told him that I was heating up my leftover Starbucks that I had yesterday morning. What's so great about this cozy drink is it lights up the room. It makes the room smell really cozy. And with all the cinnamon, with all the spice, that I added. I added the pumpkin spice creamer that I got from Target. It made it so delicious and really tasty. I made it so delicious and it's really cozy. Since I'm still sitting here sipping on it, I'm gonna go through my fall decor and so we can get started. I need to tidy up and clean the surfaces where I will be placing the autumn decor, making sure that that surfaces is really clean and then we'll begin to decorate so i decided to change my socks and change it to this cozy comfy cozy slippers so these are the home decor that we'll be working with today i did have a lot of the yellow and orange but i'm trying to not add too much of that because on this box right here 
There's a lot of orange and red. Just trying to stick with the light and airy colors. And I did share some of the stuff that I bought on my last shop with me. And I will make sure I have that link in down in the description box. So if you guys want to check that out, I think it's a lot of stuff, but I think we're just going to stick to what we have right now. And we'll get started on living room first. So this is what we'll be working with. I decided to have the balcony door open so I can bring in some fresh air. It feels so nice and sunny out. Turn on our diffuser and try out the essential oil that I purchased from Target. And then right after we have our diffuser running, we're going to be setting up our living room, the kitchen, and our bathroom. And then put a small decor in my office room and we should be all ready. So I will show you guys that at the end of the video. My friends on the internet talk to me more than my real ones do. I never seem to be good enough for him or her or even you. They say it'll always get better, but I had no one to help me through. At the end. trouble of putting everything together i really like this so far this i don't know if i should leave that there but i won't give up i'm still playing around and moving things around and see what would go with this area so far i really love it i just need to tweak it a little bit so this is a diy i'll be starting on i wanted to put these crochet around this so my idea for this diy is to use a crochet with a vase that I purchased from the thrift store, crochet and wrap it around this, and then add the floral that I purchased from TJ Maxx to place it on the vase like this. I'm gonna do a quick DIY and show you guys how it turned out. Wayward is my fickle heart. Where would I be if it weren't for your grace, your strength? I don't want to put too much stuff and clutter the table where we eat dinner. I just use this that I got from TJ Maxx. I just place it right in the middle. And these cups, I did use these last year. I really love the color. I just have four of these cups. I just have four of these cups each side of the table. I think it's really cute and really simple. <laughs> and see what I can work with. Had a rare day off On a day in We took the old car. So what I did with this section, it looks really nice, but of course it's not really part of the autumn decor. I just want to show you guys how I did this little corner. I added the cutting board that I got from the thrift store. 
and this cutting board that I got from TJ Maxx. I really think it looks really nice. It goes really well with this. Drove it far away. So I did the DIY. So this is how it turned out. So I'm just gonna add this in here. Just unravel it and like play with it and see if it will look really well. So that was the DIY. So what I did is I used the crochet yarn and wrap it around the vase and then I just tuck it in. It's just a really simple DIY. It might be really time consuming, but it was really quiet and peaceful when I was doing this DIY. So I'm happy that I did that. And it looks like it turned out really cute. It looks really cute. I think it would have been a great idea if I used the crochet and wrap around the vase. I'm just showing all of this. So far, it looks really pretty. I'm struggling right now. I'm trying to figure out what should I add in this tray. I'm gonna get started on the bathroom pretty loud we have a fan in this bathroom and we really can't control the fan that's in the bathroom show you guys how i'm going to decor this bathroom we stopped out where the trees stand quiet we walked and talked of how the This is how my pumpkin shaped sugar cookie came out. I'm not quite sure what happened to the other two pumpkins, but the other three looks perfectly fine. Anyway, I can't wait to dig in. And that is it for today's video. I am so happy I got to spend time with you guys. Tater, you want to say goodbye? Be sure to like, subscribe, and comment down below if you did enjoy this decor with me. Until next time, friends, I will see you guys on the next video. Bye! Oh, my lover, baby, you always be perfect to me. Oh. Every conversation is in your heart. Not a word could ever tear us apart, my lover, baby.